Until recently, we have not paid attention to video cameras. People have installed them in offices, houses, public areas, and they're almost unnoticeable. Now, whether you like it or not, we're all objects of surveillance. Video cameras are everywhere. For more than 18 years, I've engaged in video surveillance. During this time, we've installed tens of thousands of video cameras around the world, and I know exactly what my clients' needs are. We analyzed the existing software in the video surveillance market. We've conducted hundreds of surveys amongst our clients. It was clear there was a gap, and we wanted to offer something unique as a complete, simple solution. The problem was very clear and existing in the entire industry. All existing software was cumbersome, barely used and required staff training. All that is now in the market is sold with instructions on how to use, instead of being easy enough to simply know how to use it. You will not find instructions on how to use Facebook. You don't attend courses to learn how to edit photos on your iPhone. Or if you want to use Google Calendar, you don't need additional knowledge to use it. The simplicity is just there. Our statistics show that 89% of CCTV owners have never visited a video surveillance interface or browsed the history of footage, which even if you did, is almost an impossible task. Very often, people have a default password and they do not even know it. For several years now, we have been dealing with computer vision using neural networks and machine learning brought to life our first project, Pay Cards. This is an open source library for scanning bank cards in mobile applications. Test results showed the highest speed and quality of recognition of bank cards. Now this product is used by applications around the world. Next, we started working on facial recognition. The basis of recognition is deep convolutional network. All the research in this area started in the 1980s Due to the high demands on computing resources, the technology developed very slowly. Now, when the problem with computing resources is not so relevant, we have taught the neural network to recognize faces better than humans. But creating a well-recognized network is only part of the task. The product should fit into the existing infrastructure and be natural to the user and at the same time be pleasant to look at. In our team, there are excellent specialists in usability and design. So we made the interface very stylish with convenient features for managing video cameras. When I saw this product, I said, wow, that's exactly what my customers need. And it's simple. If I need to know when Steve will appear, I will just put an alert on and as soon as the camera sees him, I'll get a push notification to my mobile. For security, this is generally a cool thing, but you can also create a blacklist and receive a real-time alert. As for marketing, your customers can come to your store and you already know his name and what to offer him. Viewing history is made easy with two simple touches. We believe that computer vision will bring great benefits to the people very soon. That's why our development technology is open source. All the source code are published, anyone can read and also contribute to the future of this technology. The cost of the product is very important because all customers want to get a quality product and a service at a reasonable price. Blockchain and smart contracts Ethereum give us opportunity to use distributed computing resources all over the world and let us get available and transparent pricing. Unlike other software that is just designed to show you an image, we have developed a product, a complete smart interactive solution. We keep improving our algorithms and state-of-the-art results. We are so excited to be able to share the power of FaceTime. To show you how this technology can benefit your life your business, your home and loved ones.